you're about to learn how to make a paper organism. This organism is going to represent the levels of organization in a real organism, from cells, to tissues, to organs, to organ systems, and finally the full organism. Begin by folding your paper in half, hamburger style. Line up the corners carefully, then use your fingers to press the crease down. Open the paper back up again, fold the right hand side in toward the center, and the left hand side into the center. Keeping your paper folded like this, fold the bottom up to the top and make a crease in the middle. Then open up again, fold the bottom up to the crease in the middle, then fold the top down to the crease in the middle. Now you've created all the folds you need. Open your paper back up again. Now you're going to need eight different colored pencils. It doesn't matter which colors you use as long as you use eight different ones. We're gonna make pairs of cells. So write the word cell in two blocks next to each other. I made two pink cells, then two purple cells, two black cells, and so on. Keep going this way until you have eight pairs of cells next to each other. Now, when we put two or more cells of the same kind together, they form a tissue. See how when I fold it together, they, they touch each other? So the two cells make a tissue. The two blue cells are gonna make a blue tissue. The two brown cells are gonna make a brown tissue. The two yellow orange cells are going to make a yellow orange tissue and so on. It doesn't matter which colors you use as long as your tissues match your cells. Now, when we put two or more different tissues together to form, to do a job, they form an organ. So the pink tissue and the purple tissue are going to work together in an organ. So my organ is going to be pink and purple. Next to those, I have the yellow, orange, and brown tissues. They're gonna work together. See how they touch each other when I fold them together? They're gonna form a yellow and brown organ. Continue this way until your paper organism has four organs. Again, it doesn't matter which colors you chose as long as you match the colors that you started with. The colors that are in your tissues that touch each other are going to work together to form an organ. So make your colors match. Now two or more organs that work together to perform a function, like digestion or respiration, form an organ system. So on the left hand side, I have the pink and purple organ and the orange and black organ. So I'll use pink and purple to write the word organ. And black and orange to write the word system. My paper organism is only going to have two organ systems. When those two organ systems work together, when all the organ systems work together, they form an organism. Organism has eight letters and you used eight colors, so use each color one time. On the back of your paper organism, don't forget to put your name and period. Now we can unfold our organism and refold it to review the levels of organization. Two or more of the same kind of cell working together form a tissue. Two or more different tissues that work together to perform a function make an organ. Two or more organs working together make an organ system, and together they make an organism.